Thermal imaging cameras produce a crisp image in the darkest of nights. Thanks to their ability to detect potential intruders at long ranges, in total darkness, thermal imaging cameras are widely integrated in new or existing security and surveillance networks. In order to manage and control FLIR Systems thermal imaging cameras and other Nexus-enabled sensors in a network, FLIR Systems has developed FLIR Sensors Manager. FLIR Sensors Manager not only works together with FLIR Systems thermal imaging cameras, Using Nexus technology, it can also be used to control a wide variety of other sensors like radars, ground sensors and many others and to make these sensors interact with FLIR Systems thermal imaging cameras in so-called SLU to Q configurations. FLIR Sensors Manager exists in two versions, Basic and Pro. The Pro version contains all the features that are incorporated in the Basic version. On top of this, the Pro version contains a number of useful modules that will allow you to get the most out of your security network. A demo version of FLIR Sensors Manager Basic, allowing to manage one sensor, is available free of charge from our website and comes with every FLIR Systems thermal imaging camera. Let's have a look at the Basic version first. FLIR Sensors Manager allows to automatically locate FLIR Systems thermal imaging cameras in a network and to easily control them. If only one camera is connected to the network, FLIR Sensors Manager will automatically detect it and display its video. If more than one sensor is connected, you can discover them by the touch of a button in the Discovery panel and add the sensors you want to the Sensors panel so that you can manage them. If you know its IP address, you can also manually add a sensor to the network. Once the sensors are discovered, you're able to display network video from the one you choose. You can also control the sensor, zoom in and out. Focus. Pan and tilt. Other features are defining presets and creating scan lists for each camera. The operator can define a number of viewing and camera settings. Once these settings are done, he can easily have the camera look in one of the predefined positions. Playing a scan list means that the camera will automatically look at each predefined point for a defined time frame. The basic FLIR Sensors Manager also allows you to create panoramas. When using a multi-sensor camera, the daylight camera can automatically create a 180 degree or 360 degree panorama of visual images. Creating a panorama of the surveillance area with daylight images helps to easily turn the camera in the right direction in total darkness or with a very narrow field of view. This can drastically increase your situational awareness. You can position the panorama anywhere on the screen and adapt its size to see more detail.
Geomapping allows a map to be geocalibrated so that any georeference nexus sensor can be managed and displayed. You can download a map of the area of interest from any public source. Once you know the exact coordinates of two points on the map, FLIR Sensors Manager will geocalibrate the entire map. You can now geo-reference all your sensors so they're displayed on the exact location on the geo-reference map. You can display the video of any of the sensors and intuitively see which field of view and distance each sensor is covering. This feature adds usability and situational awareness and is included in the basic version of FLIR Sensors Manager. The Pro version contains a number of extra useful modules. One of them is the Video Analytics module. It allows video analytics to be performed within FLIR Sensors Manager. It includes video motion detection. FLIR's proprietary algorithm will work on thermal or visible video in the most harsh environments. Once motion is detected in an operator-defined area, an alarm will go off. Target detection with alarms based on spatial rules like tripwire crossing or areas. Crossing a line, entering or exiting an area will generate an alarm. Target detection can be done both on thermal and daylight images. Software-based thermal or daylight video tracking of moving objects for control of PTZ sensors. Another module is eStab. It provides a steady image and can be extremely useful when cameras are installed on high poles where they can be affected by wind or vibration.
radar queuing and radar tracks display allows to display real-time position and classification information of radar targets coming from Nexus-enabled radars. It allows users to command cameras to collaborate with Nexus readers in advanced radar slave modes. FLIR Sensors Manager will also display alarms on the map coming from ground sensors or fence contacts. Slew to queue activity between the cameras and the different sensors can be visually monitored. Video Wall Display allows for fully configurable video mosaic layouts supporting both network and analog frame grabber sources. Both the basic and pro version of FLIR's Sensors Manager can be configured to work in different languages, including English, French, German, Italian, Spanish, Chinese, Japanese, Russian, Arabic, Portuguese and Polish. Both versions of FLIR Sensors Manager allow multiple users to share monitoring and control of up to four FLIR Systems thermal imaging cameras. Different license packages to manage more cameras in the same workstation are available. Additional sensor licenses can be added to manage up to 50 sensors from a single workstation. Packages can be upgraded so that FLIR Sensors Manager can grow together with your security network. Get the most from your security network and manage your FLIR Systems thermal imaging cameras and other Nexus-enabled servers with FLIR Sensors Manager.